<laughs> Hi everybody, it's time once again for America's Favorite Pop Quiz. <clears throat> I'm Mr. Terry, and we're here with uh, Senior. Are you a senior? Yes. Ryan Sherwood. Let's give Ryan a round of applause for being here. And we need to do a 360 here. We've got a live audience here. Mr. Moon was so <laughs> Here we go. Uh, play along out there. It's fun. Question number one, Ryan. Um, next week is homecoming week. Mm -hmm. What is the theme of homecoming week this year? Three seconds. I'm um, sorry that sound indicates an incorrect response, audience. Oh. Oh. Uh, does anybody in the audience know what the theme of next week's homecoming is? Emily. Jungle. Something would do with jungle. Very good. Here we go, number two. Who does the, who do the Beavers play for Friday night's homecoming oh football game next week? DeForest. DeForest, you say? Yes. That is a correct answer. Nice job. <laughs> number three. Autumn is right around the corner. Do you know the official date of the start of autumn this year? October 1st, I'm sorry, that's too correct. Oh. Uh, Sunday, September 22nd. Uh, next Sunday is the answer we were looking for. Nice try, though. Thank you. You're one for three. As we move into question number four, this should be an easy one. In September, we're sort of focusing on phobias. The fear of beards and hairy faces is either pognophobia or spectrophobia. The fear of beards and hairy faces. Pognophobia is correct. <laughs> nice job. Woo! And question number five. This is tricky. This is true or false. And so it's true. Here we go. In physics, there are three laws of motion that are attributed to Newton. And if you take physics, of course, you'll probably get more details on that. True or false? True is the correct response. <laughs> nice to know. You're going to get this to them with a good writer. Your parents will be proud. Uh, you also get a very expensive pop quiz uh, pencil that you can uh, use with pride in your senior year of high school. See if you get to the bottom of it by the time you graduate. And uh, so generous, a $5 gift certificate for our school store. Thanks for playing. If you want to play pop quiz, uh, tweet me at MJT. The words pop quiz will get you on. Thanks, Ryan. Let's give him another round of applause. See you next week.